We have a consumer watchdog report on something very close at hand, your purse. Tonight we have learned that the Center for Environmental Health tested purses in retail stores and found many of them contained more lead than purse makers themselves had agreed to. Lead is linked to heart and brain problems in long term and large doses, so no one wants to be exposed unaware. And ABC's Elizabeth Leamy has this ABC News exclusive. This test reveals a woman's constant companion, her purse, contains potentially harmful lead. The Center for Environmental Health says it found lead in the sides of 43 of the 300 purses it tested in a lab, even though hundreds of handbag manufacturers have signed an agreement to severely limit the lead in their products. Lead is a stunningly toxic metal. The concern? Lead can rub off of products like purses and get into the body of a woman or her children. We find it really distressing that some of these companies had this problem. These are the five purses that contained the most lead, made by Tory Birch, Guess, House of Harlow, Nine West, and Charlotte Roos. The lab results showed the Tory Birch purse contained roughly 580 times the amount of lead that's allowed in children's toys, although of course toys are handled differently. This is one of the highest levels of lead we've ever found in a consumer product. We got Tori Birch herself on the phone to ask about the findings. Your purse had the highest lead level in this test of nearly 300 purses, and I'm just wondering, what's your response? Birch told us she was appalled and that we have strict testing protocols and are doing a full investigation. Nine West said it pulled the product in question from all stores. How do you protect yourself? The Center for Environmental Health says brightly colored purses made of plastic or vinyl are the most likely to contain lead. You can choose leather or fabric instead to have a better chance that all you're carrying is your purse. Elizabeth Leamy, ABC News, Washington.